Welcome back everybody, this is Spotlight Guy from AC Syndicate TV. And today I'm going to show you how to get your Nook color back to stock. This will erase root, it will get rid of your ROM, uh, any kind of modifications that you've put on there since you rooted. It'll make sure that it, 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 your Nook color it looks exactly the way it did when you pulled it out of the box for the, uh, the very first day after you bought it. So you're going to need to uh, turn off your Nook, that'll be step one. So just make sure it's off. Mine is already off. And then uh, make sure you have a little bit of time to do this because uh, it's kind of tricky. You might like you might mess up. And if you do, then you just have to start all over. But don't worry about it. Uh, just do exactly what I do and we should get through this first, first go around. All right, so after your Nook's powered off, you're going to want to power back on. So you're going to hold the power button until it powers on. And once you see read forever, Hold the power button to interrupt the boot process. So you're going to hold it to shut it back down. Alright, so what you did was you interrupted the boot up process. So uh, once you do that and it's shut back down, then that's, that's one. You have to do this eight times. So after we did this first time, you have to do it seven more times. Yeah, uh, this is... This is called the uh, eight interrupted boots method. So you saw what I did. I'll, ch I'll show you one more time. You're gonna hold the power button right, right until it powers up. Let go. Then we get to read forever. Hold the power down, power button down again. All right, it's shut down. All right, so like I said. You, uh, we just did it twice. You're going to need to do it six more times. And then uh, I'm going to do it real quick. I'm probably going to fast forward through this part of the video. And then I'll meet you guys back up uh, when I'm done with my eight interrupted boots. All right, so as you can see, I just did it eight times, and now it's clearing data. What's really happening right now is it's uh, you're re-imaging the Nook color during a system uh, partition. And... This is the program part. It's it's just resetting everything. It's making everything the original uh, factory settings, it's, like it says right here, given the original factory image. So hopefully that you you got your eight boot ups uh, right away, and you didn't have to start all over. So because once it gets to the boot animation, then uh, your counter goes right back down to zero. So I think I mentioned that before. But anyway, yeah. So first part is to do your eight interrupted uh, boot loads or uh, power or eight interrupted boots basically until you get to this screen and then it's going to give you your uh, the process of restoring the factory image and we have one more part right after this so I'll come back to you guys right when this is done alright so the original factory image just got installed onto my nook and uh, I'm pretty sure this will take me back to uh, the version I was on when I first bought this uh, because I think that uh, it'll store like say you bought your Nook color when it first came out so you when you do this you'll be on version 1.1 or whatever uh, version you were on when you first bought this you won't be on the newest up update so you're gonna have to do some OTA updates uh, to get yourself back to 1.4.2 uh, once you get everything set up now, uh, the method two, or no, sorry, excuse me, part two of what we're going to be doing is doing a factory reset. And what this is going to do is to clear all of your uh, slash data. It's going to pretty much just clear off any kind of mods or whatever else you did to your Nook color. So once this boots up, uh, we'll get right into that. All right, so I just went through the setup wizard and uh, set up my Wi-Fi and... Every, all the other kind of stuff and uh, I'm sorry right now for the screen flickering I have no clue why it's doing that now all of a sudden uh, it's pretty annoying so I apologize for that but uh, okay we're gonna get into the factory factory reset part so we're gonna bring up our little uh, menu right here we're gonna go to settings then we're gonna go to device info and then erase and deregister device all right, this will remove all digital books and files, including sideloaded content from this device. The titles you have purchased will remain in your uh, Barnes & Noble account. So we're going to hit Erase and Deregister Device, and then Reset Nook. 
All right, so here it is. We are completely back to uh, stock Nook color. And as you can see, I have a uh, uh, software updated notification. And I'm now at 1.0.1. .1. So I am way back to stock. This was several updates ago. So I'm going to spend the time to get myself back up to 1.4.2. And uh, yeah, that'll be it. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if, uh, if you enjoy a lot of my other videos, or if you just want to stay up to date with other things I might do with the Nook Color or any other kind of Android device I may have at the time, then subscribe to the YouTube channel, AC Syndicate TV, and uh, you can do that. Also, go to my social networking sites, Facebook, Google+, and Twitter, and that will keep you even more up to date because you'll be up to date mobily. All those links are uh, below this video in the description. As always, uh, thanks for watching. This is Spotlight Guy, signing out.